Well, during a recent restaurant health inspection, roaches were found in the kitchen. Oh boy, here is Don Dare and Food for Thought. It's a family-style restaurant that received the lowest health inspection grade. The place has been re-inspected, and you'll see that score in just a moment. The grade is a 72 at Michael's Casual Dining on Congress Parkway in Athens. That's a passing score. If it's below 70, that's considered failing. A number of critical violations were found that could potentially lead to foodborne illness. To begin with, the inspector writes he found live roaches skittering about in the restaurant. Michael's Pest Control Company was requested to pay a visit. When the dishwasher was checked, no sanitizer was running through the final rinse, but dishes and utensils are required to be washed, cleaned, and sanitized. A kitchen worker was observed handling ready-to-eat food with his bare hands, but health rules require gloves to be worn when handling food. There's more. Temperatures were off. Pulled pork found on the hot holding table was at 103 degrees, but 135 and above is the required hot temperature to kill bacteria growth. On the other end of the temperature scale, slaw and rice were at 50 degrees, but 41 and below is the safe cold temperature. Finally, French onion soup kept in the refrigerator had been there for eight days, but seven days is the maximum amount of time before prepared food must be thrown away. Now, Michael's Casual Dining has been reinspected. All of the risk factor violations were corrected, and the new reinspected grade is a 92. No need for any reinspections at the high scoring restaurants, and here are the best grades of the week. In Knoxville, Black Horse Brewery Pub on Gay Street, 100. Cafe Vicolo, also on Gay Street, scores 100. Same perfect grade at Duncan's Cafe on Locust Street in Knoxville. On Western Avenue in Knoxville, Golden Garden receives a grade of 100. In West Knoxville, Deep South Fish Shack in Hardin Valley is perfect. The Cheesy Steaks Restaurant on Winfield Dunn Parkway in Sevierville, 100. Two Aubrey's restaurants received high grades. Aubrey's in Powell on Emory Road scores a 98, same grade 98, for the Aubrey's at Cedar Bluff on Middlebrook Pike. Restaurant inspections are unannounced and inspectors show up every six months. But if you notice a violation, politely mention it to the manager. Don Dare covering Food for Thought. And as always, if you'd like to look over all of this week's health inspection scores for yourself, we've made it easy for you to do just that. They are all under the As Seen On section at WATE.com.